Hi everyone, I have a new product from SoundBot today. It is the SBOT 336. It is a wireless receiver and transmitter. Let's get right into it and do an unboxing. Today I am super thrilled to go over the SB336 with you because this is just purely an amazing product. To have something smaller than your palm fit in your hand with this many functions of a wireless receiver and transmitter is truly amazing. Let's hop right into it and open up the box and see what we're dealing with. Keep in mind it does have a wireless range up to 33 feet. It's got a 3.5 millimeter jack we'll get into and it also has multi-point connectivity which means more than one device can connect to that. Right out the box we have social media affiliate links right here and last but not least we have the manual. Let's put that to the side. All right, let's see our classic micro USB charging cable and the SB336 itself. On the side right here is our stowable 3.5 millimeter jack. On our fingerprint surface, we have our power button. TX and RX stands for transceiver and receiver mode. We'll get into that in a second. Today, we will be co-starring the SB571 Pro. If you haven't seen that video, check out the link in the description. On top of that, we will also be introducing SB572. We'll get into that later. Okay, before we get our device powered up, let's make sure it is fully charged. Charging time is about 90 minutes, give or take. And the red charging light is actually hidden behind the charging cord. Now we're going to flip the switch over to TX mode, which will allow us to transmit to a car stereo and or speaker. Next up, let's turn on our SB571 Pro. It is blinking and ready to pair. Next up, let's turn on SB336 until it is blinking red and blue, signifying it is ready to pair. One key feature is you won't notice it in the Bluetooth section of your phone. It will automatically connect. As soon as you hear that, you are good to go. Notice that there is no light on the SB336. That little shit you talking about? That's lunch money. You need to smoke that. Play to your heart's desires. Remember the 33 feet wireless range? Take your phone with you and be the DJ on the move. Next up for transceiver mode, go ahead and switch the flip over to RX. Plug in the 3.5 millimeter jack to your speaker and or car stereo until you see the red light blink and it will automatically connect via phone. Let's talk about multi-point connectivity. Now what that really means is you can connect to multiple devices. So from two different speakers, you can play the same music. Let's get into it and show you how it's done. Just like we did previously, let's just power it up. There we go. Let's turn on SB572 Pro, get into the pairing as usual. Last but not least, let's make sure SB336 is plugged in to our phone. Once you hear the classic beep, notifying you it is connected, go ahead and play to your heart's desire. Enjoy the music through all parts of the house. We're going to do an individual sound test for both to get an idea of how they sound on their own. See? This is perfect for one room. And here's SB571 Pro. Now for the ultimate sound test. Let's turn everything on. That's one. That's two. Let's pair them. That's one. Waiting for SB571 Pro. Alright, let's do it. The sound clip was pretty intense coming from inside my house. The walls were vibrating and echoes throughout the whole house could be heard. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been the review of SoundBot's SB336 2-in-1 wireless receiver and transmitter. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time.